Hi guys, Sean here from StudyClix, and in this video we're going to be looking at Theorem 7. So we have a triangle here as you can see with the labelled angles A and B and also the labelled sides A and B but in smaller letters. And to begin this theorem we're going to look at the first point which states that in a triangle the angle opposite the greater of two sides is greater than the angle opposite the lesser. So mathematically speaking, if we know that the side A is greater than the side B this implies that the angle A is greater than the angle B. And I think this makes sense intuitively, especially because if we just highlight uh, the sides, for instance, around the angle A, like so, um, these pink sides are joined by the side A, which is opposite the angle A. So you can almost think of this third side as a measurement between the sides which make up the angle A, or the sides which converge to create the angle A. So considering this side is almost a measure of the angle opposite it, I think this makes a lot of sense that uh, this implication holds true. Now the second point is just the converse statement. So if, mathematically speaking, if we know that the angle A exceeds the angle B, then we also know that the side A exceeds the side B. So yeah, that's just the same statement in reverse, um, but it is called a converse. So that is it for this theorem and I'll see you next time.